organizations to three support pre kindergarten programs. NRS 387.652, Section 1 of this bill establishes for a similar program for the department to award grants to nonprofit organizations to five support virtual pre kindergarten programs. Okay, I just want to talk about that. Who does that? Who, who does that? You know what I'm saying? Who provides grants to nonprofit agencies who are not required to, i.e., present credentials? And they don't have to present any credentials until when? They don't have to present credentials until 2026. So let's let's all understand what what's being said here and what's being allowed here and why would these programs be grandfathered in until 2026. So I'm just gonna pause right here because I need to turn TV down, but hold on, pause. So I just wanted to come on because we, the people, here in Las Vegas need to understand that this is what Nevada legislatures are getting ready to do. This is what they're doing. NRS 387.654, Section 2 of 7, this bill prescribes similar uses for a grant to support virtual pre-kindergarten aid programs. Existing law requires the State Board of Education to adopt Regulations 9 to carry out the grant program to support pre-kindergarten programs. NRS 387.656. 10 section 3 of this bill requires the state board to include virtual pre-kindergarten level programs in those regulations. Existing law requires the department to submit a 12 biennial report concerning the effectiveness of pre-kindergarten programs supported wow. by the grants. NRS 387.658 section 4 of this bill requires the department to 14 include virtual pre-kindergarten programs virtual pre -kindergarten in that report. Program. Asterisk 122 wait, wait. asterisk. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 16, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42. Now listen up. This is exciting, everybody. To the people of the state of Nevada. Represented in Senate and Assembly, do an act as follows. Section 1, Chapter 387 of NRS is hereby amended by money is available. To a new section to read as follows. 1. The Department shall, to the extent money is available, award grants of money to nonprofit organizations to support virtual pre kindergarten programs. Each virtual pre kindergarten program supported by a grant awarded pursuant to this section must a serve children who are four years of age at the beginning of the school year and whose household has a household income which is not more than 200% of the federal level. Install a computer or internet service in the household of a pupil who participates in the program if the household does not have a computer or internet service. C. Utilize a comprehensive curriculum for free kindergarten oh, that is aligned to any standards of content and performance oh, established so we for know free all kindergarten this, right? pursuant to NRS 389.520. D. Participate in any evaluation of the program or the pupils who participate in the program that is prescribed by the regulations adopted pursuant to NRS 387.656. Effectively engage the parents or guardians of the pupils and participate in any evaluation of such engagement that is required by the regulations adopted pursuant to NRS 387.656. F, provide appropriate individualized accommodations and support for, for kids pupils with disabilities. With disabilities. G, provide the comprehensive services prescribed pursuant to an RS 387.656 and H, meet the minimum standards of performance prescribed pursuant to an RS 387.656. 2. A nonprofit organization that wishes to receive a grant of money pursuant to this section must submit an application to oh, the department. Okay. The application must include 
without limitation, a, a detailed description of the manner in which the nonprofit organization proposes to, one, ensure that the virtual pre-kindergarten program supported by the grant meets the requirements of subsection 1, and, and really two, just have to use the grant of money, and b, any other information required by the department, up to $1 million. three, a nonprofit organization that receives a grant of money pursuant to this section must match the amount of the grant up to $1 million. Dollars. Mm, asterisk KB 122 asterisk. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 20. Recipient of the grant would otherwise spend on pre kindergarten programs. C. Pay the salaries of teachers and paraprofessionals or pay for other items wow. directly related to the instruction of pupils enrolled in pre kindergarten. The or Look, D. Retrofit a classroom or playground equipment so that the classroom or equipment is appropriate poverty. for pupils who are four years of age. Three. A grant of money awarded pursuant to section one of this act. Grant of money pursuant to section one of this act shall not use the money to a supplant money that the school Don't district grant. sponsor government money or organization would otherwise spend on pre-kindergarten programs or virtual pre-kindergarten programs, or b except as otherwise. Okay, enough is enough. You know, I'm going to tell you in America, everyone has a right to a free and appropriate public education. What that looks like? Well, it depends on what the parent has accepted. Obviously, you know, here in Nevada, they're used to harvesting without really providing adequate services. And they don't have the information to demonstrate whatever they're doing is working. But if it's not working for you, I encourage you to make sure it does. So if it's not working for you, then ask for assessments. They have to provide a maintenance of effort to ensure that access is happening. And you just have to work with them to ensure that you're the one that's benefiting. This is a very sad day. I mean, go back and read this. I mean, listen to the whole video. I just wanted to come in here and just say, really, a nonprofit is going to provide someone, uh, you know, a free and appropriate public education. They can provide services for children with disabilities. I mean, okay. I'm just trying to figure out how that all works in America. Till we meet again, this is Darlene Anderson signing out.